What's up? How's it going? Hope you're well. Toy Insanity here. I collect it so you don't have to. And today I'm bringing you that Five Nights at Freddy's Friday with the two plush animatronic figures from Funko. They are tall. I think that that's solid two feet. Two feet tall. They have their motion sensor activated. They do exactly one thing. Well, I guess you could say they do two things. There's a jump scare in the face, and the eyes light up. But they do they do both those features at the same time. Uh, they don't move. They're not articulated. And like I said, that's all you get that one jump scare. Accompanying the jump scare is a little flourish of music plus light up eyes. They're $50 a piece at GameStop. In fact, both of these are exclusive to GameStop. There you, there you go. It says on the package, Funko, GameStop, there you go. 50 bucks a piece. So the speaker's right here. The sensor is right above it. Right there. In this case, it's a, it's a little lower, and it, it's like pushing out on him. Come on! I mean, that is it. $50 and that's it. Mine has a scraped eye. My Freddy has a scraped eye. The, the bow is just felt. The hat is felt. Kind of cheap. I think they could have made those two pieces plastic. And then the sensor is just pushes out. It's kind of weird. That's it. So I wish you could pose the arms at least. This hook has <laughs> the jankiest hook I've ever seen. Uh, you know, that piece should have been plastic also. The eye patch is felt if you're a kid and you play with these at all, this is going to just start falling apart. The felt felt disintegrates on... Well, it gets real janky, and then it just starts falling apart on plush figures. Now, I'm just trying to cover up the sensor. It's not an actual push-me button. I do wish there had been a push-me feature... I wish, honestly, Funko had teamed up with Jimmy, this company called G-E-M-M-Y. Jimmy would have put half a dozen features at least in these things. A little bit of movement. I'm not saying actually make it walk, but just maybe sway. Make the head vibrate a little bit or something. Maybe two to three different audio pieces. Just that one, the one jump scare. I hope with the, I, you know, despite their flaws, fifty dollar pieces. I still, I still do hope they at least, for the sake of consistency, do Bonnie and Chica. Maybe they'll be Target exclusives, Hot Topic exclusives. Maybe more. I would, I kind of hope they don't do more than just the core four. Just because they're so expensive and you know they don't do a lot, but I do I do want the consistency of the core four members. I don't really care that they do 
spring trap nightmare versions. I mean, unless they're going to enhance these with a lot more features. That's it, guys. You've seen it. You've seen it. You can't pose the arms. You can't. You can't. Uh, One little music flourish, one little jump scare, no movement, no shaking, and then the, the eyes light up, kind of red. There you go. Glowing eyes and jump scare feature. This is it. Look at this. Look how plain this box is. Whatever. Guys, what do you think? You gonna get them? Fifty dollars each. You gonna get them? Maybe you already got them. Maybe they're under your tree. Maybe they're under your tree right now as we speak. Under your tree, Toy Insanity, Five Nights at Freddy's, Friday. Guys, thanks for clicking this video, and thanks for that upvote. And I'll see you next Friday with more FNAF merch. Take care. Have a great weekend, and have a great week.